Hi everyone in today's video i would like to share a story with you guys you know at certain times in our life we find it very hard to get through the day and a story helps us in getting a new perspective on our life and sometimes the moral of that story helps us to get through the day with a bit more ease now getting back to the story once upon a time there was a village in that village there lived a very wise man all the people used to come to this wise man to solve their issues and their troubles he used to give advice to the villagers and help them go on with their life one fine day a farmer came to meet this wise man and told him dear wise man yesterday my cow died and now i do not have any animals to plow my fields i am terrified that i might have to starve this season don't you think this is the worst thing that can happen to me the wise man replied maybe so maybe not the farmer was perplexed he went back and told his neighbors that the wise man had gone crazy the next day the farmer noticed a stray horse near his farm an idea struck him and he immediately captured the horse and used it for plowing his fields what he noticed was that the horse was a much better animal in farming activities than the cow had ever been the farmer realized why the wise man had told maybe so maybe not so he immediately went to the wise man and told him you were totally right my cow dying was actually a blessing in disguise don't you think this is the best thing that has happened to me the wise man again replied maybe so maybe not the farmer was again dumbstruck he went back with a confused state of mind and sat in his home the next day while the farmer's son was riding the horse he fell from it and broke his leg the farmer was totally saddened he went back again to the wise man and said oh wise man you were right my son broke his leg and now i do not have anyone to help me with the farming activities and i think we will die of starvation this season Don't you think this is the worst thing that has happened to me? Again, the wise man replied, "Maybe so, maybe not." The farmer was sure now that the wise man had gone crazy. He went back to his village and told everyone, "Don't go again to that wise man. He has gone totally crazy. He only knows one thing to say, maybe so, maybe not. What kind of solution is this?" Now, there was a war going in the nearby area. So, The next day a general came to this village and recruited all the young men for the war except the farmer's son because he had broken his leg All the young men died except for the farmer's son just because he had fell from the horse and had broken his leg Now the moral of the story is this lots of time in our life we go through very tough phases we have a bad breakup we lose our job some natural calamity strikes us and then we think this is the worst thing that has happened to us but again we have to repeat to ourselves just like the wise man maybe so maybe not because the truth is we have no idea of knowing whether this is the worst thing that has happened to us it might be it might be but we can never be sure on the other side whenever we are very happy whenever we think this is the best thing that has happened to us whenever we find that best lover we think we cannot live without this girl we cannot get find a better job than this whatever it is stay humble and tell yourself maybe so maybe not don't grow over confident always thank god for giving you those good moments always have god as your backup and support because when the lord of the universe has your back you do not need to worry at all when a tough phase comes you can say maybe so maybe not but i have god as my backup i find this personally useful and i have tried to use it in my life whenever something goes bad in my life i tell myself maybe so maybe not whenever something good happens also i say maybe so maybe not because i will let you in on a secret the happiest person in the world 
is not always happy if you go through my instagram page you will see that i'm filled with activities and my life is the best life that any guy can have yes my life is awesome but as much as awesomeness there is there are equally more down faces in my life there are a lot of things that i don't tell you guys there are a lot of things that only my close friends and my family know and that's how each one of us are right there are a lot of incidents that have put me down it has taken me a lot of time to overcome them and be the man that i am today and it was during those times that i didn't know the story but people who loved me my parents told me maybe so maybe not and you will overcome this now since i know the story i can tell this to myself but the thing is since we are humans we always need some kind of support you know that during our during our low faces we need someone it might be that smile from a random guy's face or some relative of us who calls us and says us oh hey vaishak how are you i remember you how are you i hope everything is good with you and i really love you so i ask you be that person for others you know even when you are going through a tough phase when you are saying to yourself maybe so maybe not take up that phone call that person you like call that old friend of yours and talk to him you know ask him about his life asking about how is everything is with him and maybe while talking with him you will find that your issue is no longer a issue that is how life is and that is how we humans are we need others we need bonding we need love we need care and if you can do that believe me you will be likable and you will be lovable than 99% of the rest of the people thing is everyone likes a good storyteller so i am also trying to become a good storyteller not for others sake for my own sake because whenever i feel down i look in the mirror and i repeat the story to myself so that you know i am able to motivate myself so that's it for today's video and i hope you guys like this story so do subscribe to my channel and don't forget to click the bell icon so that whenever i put a video you get an immediate notification so i want to say is that you guys are awesome and i love you a lot so until next time have a nice day and bye